You guys, tomorrow is the day. What's happening tomorrow? We're having a baby boy. Yeah. We're gonna have a baby boy in our family. Yikes. Just went and did our last shopping trip so that there will be food here for grandma to feed the, cur the girls while we're gone. Curls. <laughs> the curls, the curl girls. We had my dear friend come over today with her kids and they cleaned our entire house. It was so nice of them. So we've got the house ready and now we've got groceries. We're putting the kids to bed in a minute and then we will pack for the hospital. It's becoming very real. This little boy is coming to our family. We are very excited. This has been a long time in the making. Super excited for IVs and for needles. needles. All of them. Just a few fave. of my favorite things. Alright, what's going on? Oh, we survived. She made it. She's on the other side of the IV. It's all downhill from here. After the epidural. It's all downhill from here. Yeah. Yes, the nurse was very good. Super brave when it comes to needles. She wants to be a nurse one day. <laughs> it better be a real picture of him. That was her okay, so Josiah sent a text to the girls and you see? with a picture of a baby and told them we had the baby, which is not nice because we have not had the baby. This is Aspen's response. She's wanting to make sure that we give her a real picture of the baby. <laughs> See if I can pull up. It's very funny. This is so scary. What is so scary? This. Oh, they just broke my water. Oh man. And now, now the important part. <laughs> now Daddy is <laughs> Okay, so they just called anesthesia. They're gonna come up and give me my epidural. Got you go wee one. Because my contractions are painful. Off the hizzook. I would say I'm a five, almost a six. Oh. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. If I can make it through the epidural, then it's just smooth sailing from there on out. This is now serious business. <laughs> Very serious. Charlotte has her epidural now, and She's half of her body's feeling good. <laughs> Still feeling the contractions. So. Hoping it kicks in. Yep. Quickly. It's about 9.30 in the morning. So, might have a baby in like two and a half hours. Yay. Cray cray. Yes. Exciting. Charlotte is now on her side because the epidural has not quite kicked in on her left side. I'm feeling better though. That was really painful, that last contraction. Good. I'm hoping really that we're helped. Yeah. Okay. okay. Alright. Here's the sleepy eyed assassin. <laughs> It is almost three. All right, it is three after three. Three ten, and still Wednesday, <laughs> the twenty-first. 
but we're getting closer. I'm at eight, so any time now. I'm getting all set up. Yep. Yay. <gasps> Oh, we got him. Face that Bentley makes. It's baby Corver. We're still watching his oxygen levels. He's having a little bit of labored breathing. Look, he came to visit us at the hospital. Got all the girls. Myself, so today she put him on for me. Hmm. Bentley's holding a baby boy. You can't hear me? This is so cute. <laughs> Mom, are his eyes blue? Um, it's too hard to tell, but he will have blue eyes. I know, in the pictures they looked black. Yeah, he'll have blue eyes. Boys. What do you think of your new brother, Aspen Bree? He's so cute. Should we keep him? Yes. <laughs> what do you think? Should we keep him? So cute. Why would we adopt him and give him away? I'm teasing. He has lots of hair. Bentley, good job, honey. Good yeah, job. Brother, huh? Look at his ears. His ears are actually pretty big. Have you dropped him? <laughs> Should we name him Corver Josiah? No. Why not? Corver J. We talked about that. You could call him Corver J for short. But Corver Josiah. Bentley, do you love him? Yeah. Oh, he's so adorable. Yeah. I think he's really happy you guys are here. Brindley Boo has a runny nose, so she's not going to hold cute baby Corver today. You'll have to hold him soon, though, Bryn. Mom, I can see you back. He looks even get fed when he's Oh, because it's going to be kind of hard. <laughs> Yeah, maybe he'll this. eat. Mom, he's going like this. Beck, come sit down on the pillow. Uh, maybe he's eat. like, I'm hungry. <laughs> All right, we're down at the nursery. They are putting an IV in um, Corver and doing labs because he's still having a hard time breathing. So. Trying to figure out what's going on. They're gonna start antibiotics on him as a precaution. He's so cute, I just wanna hold him. Corver. She's just about to get a couple of 
lab work and IVs. Look at his beautiful hair, his handsome hair. You gotta learn boy words. Handsome hair, not beautiful. He's so handsome. If you listen carefully, you can hear him grunting. That's what concerns them. Yeah. <laughs> He's so sweet. His baby quarter. He just ate. Mm, he's back to sleep. That's what he does best, huh? Yeah. He's a good sleeper. <laughs> <laughs> mm, so cute. This little sweetheart's just sleeping with his mouth open. Of course, she closes it now. <laughs> Corver is doing much better. They put him on the antibiotic yesterday, and um, Charlotte's been nursing him every three, two to three hours, and he seems to be responding well, which is great. We're hoping that uh, he's able to go back, go home tomorrow, Saturday the 24th. They're thinking maybe around afternoon, maybe midday, something like that. So we'll see if. Uh, that ends up happening, it's going to be kind of contingent on the fact that um, he has to be improving and he has to be showing signs that he'll be able to handle going home. And, and, and then there's no bacteria growing on his labs. Exactly. So, anyways, um, and Sharla, she's doing pretty good, right? Yeah. Good. So, everything is looking shower. good. Sharla got the shower. <laughs> the hot water takes forever to get hot but she's <laughs> looking good and now feeling we, better hopefully got a little bit of rest this morning after a long night yep now we're so, gonna go see Corver and feed him yep. so we'll keep you posted look who came to that see me sorry my girls oh I've missed them so much they're, gonna They're eating their, my leftovers. Alright, <laughs> so. And they brought me. Mom's new extra no, there's just the one fork. They brought me a snow cone, a mango tango, which is delicious. Did you like it? Oh, yeah, it's really good. good. Now we're going to let him go look at Corver through the window. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He says, Dad, why'd you wake me up? See, he's got a little IV in his hand. Oh, he's so little. I know. He's oh. precious. <laughs> Wait, so what are all those cords? What are the animals? Yeah, they put those on me. Those are to monitor his yeah. heart rate. They put and, those on me. Yeah, and then one of them's an IV, and one of them's oh. to monitor <laughs> um, his breathing. <laughs> <laughs> he did not like being unwrapped. He says, Dad, I was warm. He's <laughs> <laughs> so <Aww>. cute. <laughs> His little tongue's so small. It's like... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you put his hand on hot? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The pediatrician just came in. It's Saturday morning. And he said that baby Corver can go home. I'm so excited, so happy. It's been super long here in the hospital. They've been wonderful, but I'm dying to get home. Josiah went, went home yesterday and was with the girls and spent the night there, so he's here alone. Last night and this morning, and it's been lonely, and I've missed him, and, it's, and I've just wanted to hold my baby and get him out of the NICU, and so everything looks good. We're going home. Yay. Corver's home. Yay. We're just burping him right now. I'm holding him. Oh my gosh, he looks ten times bigger. Hi, Corver. No Addie's holding baby Corver. Sleeping. Can my guys sleep? I'll have them. He's so cute. Oh, I don't want to touch it. His eyes are kind of opened.
Are you waking up a little bit? He's grumpy. <laughs> you being grumpy? Are you going poo poo? No. no. Uh, he's holding on to my thumb. Yeah. Well, you're taking pictures. Bentley's documenting and I'm documenting. Whoa, that's a lot of pictures. Thanks. <laughs> Look who Aspen has. Are you in love, Aspen? The camera makes him look so big, but he is just tiny. He loves his sister. Hey, Bent. Bentley. Will you sing the song about your brother that you love? I cannot tell you how happy we are to be home, be out of the NICU, be out of the hospital, just be in our own house, our fun family. We have missed these crazies.